Did you know there is a real-life World War II submarine docked at San Francisco's Fisherman's Wharf? And this morning, our Malou Nubla had a chance to explore what it would have been like to work on board. Hi, Malou. Hi, Danny and Jess. It's a beautiful day here on the bay. We are on the USS Pompanito with Aaron here on the forward deck. And this has been here since, oh, it actually was built in 1943. Correct. So she was built in 90, 1943, served till 45, sunk six ships, damaged four, but rescued 73 POWs out of the water that were British and Australian. We've been open to the public since 1982 on this pier, and it's been 40 years since we've been serving the public. We're part of a nonprofit called San Francisco Maritime National Park Association, and that organization existed for about 72 years. So there's a lot of history here at the waterfront. Yeah, it's really, I mean, so nice just to be on board. I've never really been on board, especially on the forward deck. How large is this submarine and how deep did it go? So this boat um, is about 311 feet long and its crush depth is 600 feet. So as long as you don't go beyond 600, you should be fine. Oh my gosh, how do they even do that? Well, it took a lot of skilled sailors. So um, today, fortunate for us, we have Dominic Boncourt that will be joining us later and you can ask him what it takes to qualify <laughs> on boats. So a couple of things here, Aaron. The broom up there. Yes. Why is that up there? <laughs> the, the real story, not the false. Yes. Okay. So the real story, it represents a clean sweep. It means that it swept the sea clean of all of its enemies and came back into port victorious. I didn't know that. And then right here on the front, what is this? That is a 40 millimeter Bofor. So it's one of the two guns that would be up top there. So just aft of the conning tower, we have a second one. And it took us over 30 years to put these guns into their proper place. And then now she's very close to the way she looked right before she was decommissioned in 45, going out on her seventh war patrol, leaving San Francisco. Okay, all right, so we're just showing you outside here right now. So we're actually gonna go down there and talk to a Dom, a submariner, a real submariner? Real submariner. Okay. Yeah, and he's like your favorite uncle your parents don't want you to hang out with, but we love <laughs> him anyway. He's one of our favorite guys. All right, let's go. <laughs> Hey, how you doing? Hey, hey, nice trip coming down here. What? You know that? What's because that? if you fall, you see you didn't trip. Yeah. But had you tripped, do you know what you're supposed to do? What? Yell all the way down so they know where to look for you. <laughs> the other thing, wave your arms. You can always be number one to fly. <laughs> so what are you gonna do about that one? Huh? You're funny. <laughs> okay, where are we right now? This is forward torpedo room. Forward torpedo room. room. Yep. Well, why? So that means that there were torpedoes in here? That, that's what these are. Okay, torpedoes. All right, yeah. and then what about the... So wait, people, they slept in here? Yep, slept there, yeah. How many people? Fourteen. Up to fourteen, yeah. Wait, two on a bunk? No, one. You see, you got, you got, <laughs> no, right now there's only five rigged here, but normally there's... You get 12, 12 six and six, and then the, the bridal suite. There's a bridal suite? Well... <laughs> It was affectionately known as a bridal suite. Uh, there's a loading hatch here, and this ladder don't exist. But uh, after you load out your fish, you would turn around, close the uh, loading hatch. Okay. Put it in strong back, and then sling two more bunks up there for guys to sleep. All yeah. right. So you are a real life submariner. What does that mean? I am a qualified submariner. The dolphins uh, are qualification pin. The idea is I'm. Um, by requirements, I am supposed to get, be able to operate every major piece of equipment on the boat. Okay. I can learn up, start the engines. I can go back on a propulsion cubicle. I can operate the sticks. Oh, I can, can load you get this and thing fire to move right now? Huh? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Well, can you take us to the control room and show us what's going on in there? Oh, sure. Yeah, right. No problem. Yeah. This is kitchen. No, it's a small kitchen just for snacks and stuff for the officers. All the food is from the galley back aft. Okay, so what's this whole area? Keep going. This is the okay. officer's country. Hey, you still got your brake lights on. Could you, uh, could you hit the gas? <laughs> could you hit the gas, Dom? Oh, okay. This is the boardroom. This is officer's country. You got two officers over here, another two here. You got the captain's stateroom right here. You got Boys Town, three junior officers. This is over here. Okay, so this is the control room. We have the patrol routes here, uh, Dom. Do you know what all these buttons do in here? <laughs> it's a requirement, yes. 
No, uh, it's part of your qualification. Okay. okay. It's an air manifold, it's a bow planes, it's stern plane operating gear, a hydraulic manifold, a Christmas tree. The Christmas tree has uh, got to be all green. It usually it's an indication of all the appropriate o uh, openings in the hull that have to be in the right position for you to continue to dive. So wow. when he says green board, Green board. The diving, the green board, the diving officer continues to dive. Okay. If you don't have a green board, you better worry about aborting. Okay, okay, worry about aborting. I should abort right now then. <laughs> all right, Dom, thank you so much. Make sure you all check out the USS Pompanito here at Fisherman's Wharf at Pier 45. Thank you so much. Oh, nice to be here. <laughs> okay, that is so cool, but I just yeah. want to let it be known we would not survive if I was running that ship. I would just press every button like this. <laughs> that's why That's why you need Dom, and I can't imagine what he says off camera, so oh definitely uh, uncle material there. Thanks, <laughs>